Hello, beautiful people of YouTube. My name is Scully, and welcome to what I'm going to consider a very interesting video. If you guys haven't taken notice, I've been playing a lot of Pokemon. I've actually been spamming a lot of Pokemon Let's Plays within the last two, three days. And uh, I've been playing Pokemon for quite a while now. Pretty much since the beginning. Favorite aspects of Pokemon is obviously the collecting, the trading here and there, and uh, also a lot of breeding. I love doing breeding more than anything. Usually towards the end game, breeding perfect IVs, shiny Pokemon is just one thing I like to do. I get a lot of enjoyment out of doing that. With the addition of Pokemon Home, this application gave you the feature to be able to transfer Pokemon from previous games onto the Switch. We all know this. However, no matter how hard we try, there are going to be some Pokemon out there that we will just never be able to get, uh, i.e. event Pokemon, or maybe even some legendaries. But uh, yesterday, I was on the web, just kind of searching, and I was wondering if you could buy Pokemon. And to my surprise, there's actually a ton of people on eBay offering services to sell Pokemon to you. Now before we carry on with this video, I'm just gonna be straight up, this video is not sponsored by anybody. I'm kind of just doing this out of surprise and my own free will. But did you know you can actually buy Pokemon off of eBay? Complete national decks, living decks, so yesterday, I went shopping to see if these guys were legit, and it brought me to this page here. All 807 non-shiny Pokemon home completion, fast delivery, ditto, and event Pokemon. Yeah, this is uh, pretty nutty, and even more so, this is pretty cheap. Just a little under $7, and you can have all these Pokemon. Now, there are more than just this guy doing it. However, this is the service that I went with uh, for specific reasons. One, I don't want the shiny Pokemon. I get the shinies on my own. And uh, two, this didn't come with any of the Galar Pokemon. And I wanted to get the Galar Pokemon on my own as well. One of the downsides of this particular service is that you have to have Pokemon premium already or before you trade over. Some of the benefits is you don't have to give away account information or you're not receiving account information. The process in which he gave me the Pokemon was actually pretty simple. So again, you need to have Pokemon Premium, but then you set your Pokemon Home to receive Pokemon. Eventually, Pokemon Home, if you have Premium, I gotta emphasize this, it will give you a code. And I gave that code to the seller and he automatically transferred all these Pokemon into my Pokemon home, making this process quick and painless. And he did this within probably five minutes of me completing the order. Now, are these Pokemon completely legitimate for battle? Most likely not. However, if I'm planning on using any Pokemon for competitive battle, it's going to be Pokemon that I've bred myself. More than anything, I just wanted these Pokemon to complete my national decks. And I also made sure, like I said, not to get any of the Galar Pokemon. That way I'm still willing and surprised to see what Pokemon Sword and Shield has to offer. At least in the terms of new Pokemon. I mean, honestly, this is a fair price. 807 Pokemon, including some breeding dittos and some event Pokemon for just under 7 bucks? It's definitely not a bad deal. So what we're gonna do here is actually go into Pokemon Home and check out all the Pokemon that I got. So here we are in Pokemon Home, and if you see on the right hand side of the screen, I have 1,692 out of 6,000 Pokemon. Most of that is to do with the Pokemon that I purchased. And these are just some of the Pokemon that he gave me, but essentially it gave me everything before Generation 7. And uh, I can see this being beneficial for people who don't have a lot of time to invest in Pokemon games or for people who are trying to collect as many as possible. Like I said, there were people out there offering different services, but I wanted to get a service for me that didn't spoil the majority of the fun. This one allowed me to get the Pokemon that I needed, but also allows me to play the game at the way I want without overdoing it. Another thing about this is I don't think there's any rules for Nintendo saying that you can't do something like this. I wouldn't see why. However, I'm pretty sure that the Pokemon that you do receive from these people are unable to be used in rank matches. I mean, you can use them, but it's a bannable offense. But like I stated earlier, if there's any Pokemon that I use in rank, they're always Pokemon that I breed myself. All these Pokemon here in my competitive box are Pokemon that I've 
bread myself. So I feel like this gives me the opportunity to do new things with my channel. As you guys see here, I have a whole bunch of extra legendaries that I'm probably never going to use, and I'm considering giving them away, probably like on live streams on my channel. When I get to the end game in Pokemon Sword and Shield, I'll be focusing more of my attention on breeding perfect shiny Pokemon, and I'm considering during those live streams giving away some of these legendaries because I'm definitely not going to need them. I just really need one of each. I pretty much had most of the legendaries, all but Zorora, but I'm glad I finally got that one because the event for him is long gone. So yeah, if you guys are interested, there is a link in the description that will lead you to the ad on eBay. You can do this and not have to worry about the stupid outrageous trades on the GTS if you have Pokemon Premium. And also, when I reach Endgame in Pokemon Sword and Shield, stay tuned for my live stream where I'll be giving away some of these Pokemon. So, with all that said, folks, I think I'm going to end the video here. If you guys enjoyed the video, please drop me a like. You know I'd always appreciate it. Also, if you are new to my channel, why not subscribe? You know I'd appreciate that too. I got more Pokemon Sword and Shields Let's Play coming up. Also Animal Crossing, so stay tuned. I will see you guys later. My name is Scully, and I'm signing out. Goodbye.